in the constellation of Lyra, there is a star called Vega, around which orbits planets that researchers suggest the feline extraterrestrials came from. After a war with the reptilian race known as the Draco, that saw the destruction of their home planet, the feline race dispersed throughout the galaxy to become one of the most widespread and prolific species in the known star systems. They were a group of beings that actually originated from a different universe. So these were beings that held the evolution of a multi-universe that was not our universe. Then when that experimentation of separation from reality or separation into reality ended, they came to help start the process in our universe. They came in through a different portal to our galactic center in order to create physical versions of themselves in the Lyran system. These beings existed at a much higher dimensional levels. When we look at them having something like 12 strands of DNA, it was said that they could come through certain portals and stargates around our planet. And when they did, they were able to interface with us and move through these places in ways that we don't have the capabilities to with our current DNA. There are several strong lineages of felines that I believe have interacted with Earth. One of these particular racial lines, I believe, comes from the Syrian system and are known by some as the Syrian white lions. Many others come from the Lyran star system, where we have a variety of different humanoid cat races. So in many ways, I believe that a lot of the Lyran cat races and species are warriors that have worked with other races to provide security and guardianship around the galaxy. The Irma would be classed as probably one of the most prolific of the races in that they are in all corners of the universe and have many, many colonies everywhere. So they are definitely prolific probably more so than anyone else. When they dress up, they like to wear finery. They like to have their capes. They like to have their blue jumpsuit type things and they put decorations on it. So they're very showy and very flashy. But when, the way they talk, you can imagine as if like a lion or a tiger were talking, they would still have that growly, rumbly sound when they talk, but at the same time, they have a telepathic influence. Most folks that have interactions with these feline beings tell us that they're a highly advanced multi-dimensional or meta-terrestrial race that is interfacing with us from a higher dimensional level. And so they will see different outlines of them be more transparent, that they have a metamorphic and telepathic way of communicating, and that they are a higher evolved race. They are known to be circulated throughout the universe. They have colonies everywhere. They number in the trillions. and. They are very, very fierce fighters, so much so that even the ruling class Draco that are so large are actually afraid of them.